man buries body he believes is his son's then gets a call from a pallbearer saying his son is alive man thought he buried son, but later found him alive Frank J. Kerrigan, 82, thought he had buried his son. When he received a call from a friend who told him his son, Frank M. Kerrigan, was actually alive. A California man buried a body he believed was his son's in a $20,000 funeral family members described as a beautiful send-off. Less than two weeks later, on May 23rd Frank J. Kerrigan, 82, got a phone call from a friend who told him, your son is alive. The family is filing a lawsuit against the Orange County Coroner's Office, whose mistakes caused the misidentification and ensuing grief. The mix-up began on May 6, when the Orange County Coroner told the elder Kerrigan that his son, Frank M. Kerrigan, 57, had been found dead behind a Verizon store in Fountain Valley, the Orange County Register reported. Pennsylvania family asked for dog's ashes, got his frozen body instead Kerrigan told the news outlet that when he offered to identify the body, the coroner's office assured him that the man had already been identified as his son through fingerprints. But Kerrigan later learned that when coroner officials ran the dead man's fingerprints through a database, zero matches were returned. When Frank was found to be alive, the man's fingerprints were re-entered into the database.